I am here today to show you the new Gaja Espresso Pure and Gaja Espresso Color. Now this is an entry level machine and it's made with ABS plastic and it's only 14 inches tall so it fits comfortably under any counter. It's our lowest priced machine that gets you into the market but it's still a very high quality machine. It has a lot of the same components as our other machines. I want to show you what we have here. The porter filter. 58 millimeter diameter, chrome plated brass, same exact ones you find in the commercial machines. The brew group, full size diameter shower screen, great water distribution over the coffee. And then here's the boiler, a stainless steel boiler, lots of power, can heat up very quickly to brewing temperature and a steaming temperature. On the top of the machine we have a steam knob. This knob here controls the flow of hot water or steam through the steam wand. The steam wand is located down here on the side of the machine. As you can notice it's on a ball joint and rotates in any direction. There's a lot of height there, over four inches, so you can get a full-size 20-ounce pitcher underneath with ease. The water reservoir is located on the back and can be easily removed and brought over to the sink to fill up and then brought back. Now this water reservoir will hold 42 ounces of liquid. And the drip tray is located on the front of the machine and it slides right out and it has a cover that can be removed. Again, you can empty it out and then place it back into the machine. The controls on the machine are located on top. Over here we have the coffee switch. This starts and stops the brewing process, starts and stops the pump. The light over here is the main power light. This goes on wherever the machine is turned on. This one over here, when green, lets you know that the boiler is up to steam temperature or brew temperature, depending on which mode you're in. And this switch over here will put you into the steam mode when you're ready to froth your milk. Now some of the accessories that you're gonna get with your machine are gonna be three filter baskets. We've got one for a single shot, one for a double shot, and finally, one for an ESE pod, and it's indicated here with a C inside. Now, what an ESE pod is easy serving espresso, and it's a standardized size, so you can find it at any local grocery store and also here at Whole Latte Love. And you'll also be able to find it made by Illy, Lavazza, and Gaja, to name a few. The machine will also come with a tamper and a coffee scoop, so you have the perfect measure each time. You want to show them how to brew on this, Todd? Sure, I'd be happy to. Now, are you using a double filter basket? Or? Yep, I'm using a double. I'll do use a double shot filter basket and I'll brew into two uh, shot glasses so we can get a good look at it. And so for that double shot, he's using about 14 grams of coffee. Mm -hmm. There we go. Now, Todd, I love an Americano. Can you make me one of those? Here's a cup. Sure, we can do that. <laughs> Americano, basically, it's an espresso mixed with hot water. So you can get a full cup of coffee out of these machines. You get all the flavor of the espresso, but not the strength. So we'll just put the espresso into our cup, open the steam knob here, and turn on the pump. And there you go. Thank you very much. Mm. Cheers. Cheers to you. So if you're looking for an entry-level machine that has all the commercial elements and you want to be able to make cappuccinos and lattes and Americanas in your own home, come take a look at the new Gaja Espresso Pure or Color.